Hello and good morning everybody. It's Miss Clara here and I am so excited to share some fun new songs with you all today. Thank you so much for tuning in. We are broadcasting live from Miss Clara's Mini Musicians located in Brookfield, Illinois, just a little ways outside of Chicago. And this song, uh, this set of songs I should say, are going to be mostly geared to kids from about two years old to about six. If there's anybody in your life besides your little one that you think might enjoy this, please go ahead and tag them now. They could be anywhere from here all the way to California with this virtual platform. You can share music class with friends and family all over. So as much as I really, really, really wish we could do these classes in person, I am missing my little mini musicians more than I can possibly tell you. But uh, until then, my heart is truly warmed by the idea that I have students who have never been with us before who are finding us and loving our music classes all the way from here to London. So thank you. Hello Nia and Emily and Cecilia, Logan and Clara. Good morning. And speaking of good morning, let's go ahead and sing our good morning song, my friends. Do you remember? First, we get a sunshine and we put it high over our heads just like this. Perfect. Here we go, friends. Good morning, sun. Good morning, trees. Good morning, leaves in the breeze. Good morning to the friends I see. Good morning to you and me. Good morning, earth. Good morning, sky. Good morning, birds flying high. Good morning to the bugs I see. Good morning to you and me. Good morning to you and me. Oh, wonderful, my friends. We're going to try that one more time, starting again with our sunshine. And please go ahead and keep putting your names and your children's names into the comment section because I have my trusty pal, Mr. Clara here, sharing all those names with me so I can say hello. Here we go, friends. Good morning, sun. Good morning, trees. Good morning, leaves in the breeze. Good morning to the friends I see. Good morning to you and me. Good morning, earth. Good morning, sky. Good morning, birds flying high. Good morning to the bugs I see. Good morning to you and me. Good morning to you and me. Thank you for singing along at home. And now I'd like to say hello to some of my friends. All right, are there any names to say hello to right now? Maddie and Dylan, Jim and Charlotte, and Tail, Liam and Caden, Zara and Keon. Some new friends and some familiar friends. Hello, my friends. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, my friends. Hello. Can you clap your hands? Can you roll your arms? Hello, my friends, hello. Hello, babies, hello, hello, hello. Hello, babies, hello. Can you bounce up and down? Can you sway side to side? Hello, babies, hello. Hello, toddlers, hello, hello, hello. Hello, toddlers, hello. Can you shrug your shoulders? Can you flap your arms? Hello, toddlers, hello. Hello, children, hello, hello, hello. Hello, children, hello. Can you flick your fingers? Can you shake your hands? Hello, children, hello. Twirl your fingers, can you pat your head? Hello, grown-ups, hello. Will you sing for me? Hello, Miss Clara, hello, hello, hello. Hello, Miss Clara, hello. Can you wiggle your fingers? Can you wiggle your ears? Hello, Miss Clara, hello. Wonderful, my friends. And it looks like I have some more friends to say hello to. Hi, Reese. Hi, Matthew. Hello, Aria and Lila and Anna Marie and 
Alexis and Jackson. Brooke is here, Shelby and Isaac are here, and Noah is here. Thank you for checking in. And again, if you're just joining us, we are recording this live from my studio, Miss Clara's Many Musicians. As I'm sure everybody on this planet knows, we are indefinitely closed. And so this is my way of keeping the music going. If you are enjoying yourself, please consider making a financial donation today. I know uh, we are all impacted differently, but if you're having fun and you're maybe you're getting something done while your kids are tuning into an educational activity, please, please consider making a small donation or a large donation uh, using the information found on my in my comments. So that's enough talk about money. I don't like talking about money. I like talking about music with my friends. And we are gonna help our friend Johnny build a house. There he is. Let's stand up together, my friends. Okay, so our friend Johnny is going to build a house with us and he's going to start with just one hammer. Are you ready, friends? Here's my hammer. Okay. Johnny works with one hammer, one hammer, one hammer. Johnny works with one hammer, then he works with two. Johnny works with two hammers, two hammers, two hammers. Johnny works with two hammers, then he works with three. You ready? Johnny works with three hammers, three hammers, three hammers. Johnny works with three hammers, then he works with four. Johnny works with four hammers, four hammers, four hammers. Johnny works with four hammers, then he goes to sleep. Oh, we're gonna take a little rest, my friends. But that's enough rest. It's time for us to get back to work. Are you ready? Get out your first hammer. And here we go. Johnny works with one hammer, one hammer, one hammer. Johnny works with one hammer, then he works with two. Johnny works with two hammers, two hammers, two hammers. Johnny works with two hammers, then he works with three. Johnny works with three hammers, three hammers, three hammers. Johnny works with three hammers, then he works with four. You ready? Johnny works with four hammers, four hammers, four hammers. Johnny works with four hammers, then he goes to sleep. Hmm. Oh, that was a good rest, my friends. But now it's time for us to get out our drum so we can go ahead and find anything at your house that you can use as a drum. Here is my drum and whatever you have at your house is perfect. It might look just like my drum or it might be a little different. Maybe it's a mixing bowl, maybe it's just a table. Anything you find that you can bang on and make some music on is perfect. All right, friends, let's find our beat together. Here's my first one. I'm going to make it a little different. 
Tickle, tickle, bang, bang, bang. You try. Tickle, tickle, bang, bang, bang. Whoosh. Very good. My turn. Pat, pat, clap. Pat, pat, clap. Can you try that pattern at home? Pat, pat, clap. Pat, pat, clap. Whoosh. Very good. Last one. Tap, 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 tap. Elbows. You try. song all about these little eggs with the little tiny baby birds that are going to hatch soon. And remember, we never ever touch a real nest, okay? So this one is make-believe, even though it looks really real, but I never want anybody to touch a nest because those birdies need to get bigger and stronger so that they can fly off on their own. And do you remember what little baby birds like to eat? That's it, they love to eat worms. So we are going to put down our special nest and we're gonna stand up together, my friends, and sing a song all about these really special birdies. Okay, did you see how I had a nest in my hands earlier? I want you to pretend that you have a nest in your hands just like this. Okay, friends, here we go. Little Robin builds her nest and waits so patiently. Then one sunny afternoon she meets her hatchlings three. Open wide, open wide, little tiny beaks. Open wide, open wide, little tiny squeaks. Baby Robin's tiny wings get stronger every day. Then one sunny afternoon they start to fly away. Let's fly together, friends. Fly away, fly away, soaring way up high. Fly away, fly 
we've landed in our nest again. Can you show me your nest? Wonderful. Little Robin builds her nest and waits so patiently. Then one sunny afternoon she meets her hatchlings three. Open wide, open wide, little tiny beaks. Open wide, open wide, little tiny squeaks. Baby Robin's tiny wings get stronger every day. Then one sunny afternoon they start to fly away. Fly away, fly away, soaring way up high. Fly away, fly away, soaring through the sky. Fly, 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 fly. Wonderful. Let's sing this one more time, my friends. You have your nest. Excellent. And so now let's see if maybe you know some of the words since we've already sung it a couple times. I bet you could sing with me, especially the fun flying part at the end. Here we go. Little Robin builds her nest and waits so patiently. Then one sunny afternoon she meets her hatchlings three. Open wide, open wide, little tiny beaks. Open wide, open wide, little tiny squeaks. Baby Robin's tiny wings get stronger every day. Then one sunny afternoon they start to fly away. Fly away, fly away, soaring way up high. Fly away, fly away, soaring through the sky. Fly, fly. Fly, 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 fly. Oh, friends, that was so much fun. I hope you had a blast flying around your living room or your bedroom. We can sit back down now. And since we're out in nature, I thought it would be really fun to talk again about the cool and beautiful butterflies. I think they're on their way now. Yes, they are. Oh, I see some really nice orange butterflies and pink butterflies and blue butterflies. And I also see we have some friends to say hello to. Hi, Lennox. Hi, Lincoln. Violet and Avery are out there and Callum. Oh, it's so good to see so many friends joining us today and look right over here. That is something really special. Do you remember what that is? That is a little egg for the, for the caterpillar inside. And we are going to do a special rhyme all about that caterpillar turning into a beautiful butterfly. So show me your leaf and let's point to a tiny little egg on the leaf. Are you ready? Here we go. A tiny little egg sat on a great big leaf. Out popped the caterpillar, hungry as can be. He crunched and he nibbled on everything in sight until he got so big that he could not have one more bite. He rolled himself up tightly in a soft and silky wrap. Then he closed his eyes and fell asleep for a long, long nap. He woke up feeling squished and tried to stretch his many legs. But to his surprise, he found that he had giant wings instead. He nibbled his way out and fluttered way up in the sky. The caterpillar has become a beautiful butterfly. Oh, wonderful. Do you see how I made my butterfly friends? You can hook your little thumbs together and flutter all around. Great, that one had a lot of words though. And I know when things have a lot of words, it can be a little hard to keep up. So let's try it again. And you can just say however many words you know. Maybe it's just one word, maybe it's lots of words, but you just follow along however you like, friends. Here's my leaf and I'm gonna point to my egg. A tiny little egg sat on a great big leaf. Out popped the caterpillar, hungry as can be. 
He crunched and he nibbled on everything in sight until he got so big that he could not have one more bite. He rolled himself up tightly in his soft and silky wrap. Then he closed his eyes and fell asleep for a long, long nap. He woke up feeling squished and tried to stretch his many legs. But to his surprise, he found that he had giant wings instead. He nibbled his way out and fluttered way up in the sky. The caterpillar has become a beautiful butterfly. Oh, friends, that's wonderful. Thank you for following along. And now if you have something at home that you can use for sticks, Maybe now is a great time to find that, my friends. I'm gonna put my sticks on my shoulders in rest position, and we are gonna go check out a garden with lots and lots of flowers and vegetables. Friends, look at that. It looks like we have some pretty daffodils and posies and some roses. Oh, and some super yummy vegetables. I see some broccoli and potatoes and carrots and peppers and tomatoes. Oh, wonderful, my friends. So we are gonna do a special rhyme about all of these yummy vegetables and these beautiful flowers that we've planted. And again, you might have sticks or you might use markers or wooden spoons from the kitchen. Whatever you have is perfect. Just slow it down just a little bit. Here we go. Rosies and posies and daffodils too. We're planting some flowers for me and for you. Potatoes, tomatoes, and broccoli too. We're planting a garden for me and for you. Rosies and posies and daffodils too. We're planting some flowers for me and for you. Potatoes, tomatoes, and broccoli too. We're planting a garden for me and for you. And rest. All right, friends, let's see if you had your listening ears on. Did you hear what kind of flowers we planted? We planted roses and posies and daffodils. And then what kind of vegetables? We planted potatoes and tomatoes and even some broccoli. All right, now that we remember everything that we planted, let's see if we can say some of the words together. And this time I'm gonna go a little bit slower. Here we go. Rosies and posies and daffodils too. We're planting some flowers for me and for you. Potatoes, tomatoes, and broccoli too. We're planting a garden for me and for you. Rosies and posies and daffodils too. We're planting some flowers for me and for you. Potatoes, tomatoes, and broccoli too. We're planting a garden for me and for you and rest. All right, friends, for those of you who might be joining us for the first time, rest position is where we put our instruments between songs and rhymes. So we make sure our listening ears are ready and we're not distracted by instruments, right? So for sticks, that goes on our shoulders. And now we're gonna try this rhyme again. We went medium and then we went slowly. So now it's time to go. You got it, fast, here we go. Rosies and posies and daffodils too. We're planting some flowers for me and for you. Potatoes, tomatoes, and broccoli too. We're planting a garden for me and for you. Rosies and posies and daffodils too. We're planting some flowers for me and for you. Potatoes, tomatoes, and broccoli too. We're planting a garden for me and for you. And rest. Thank you, my friends. Great job in rest position. Hello to Mary Ellen and hello to Susan. Thank you for joining us today. Don't forget, friends, go ahead and put your child's name in there so I can give your child a special hello. And also, I create these images and slides every week, so I can't do immediate um, requests. But if there's a song or a rhyme that you happen to know from my classes, please go ahead and put it in the comment section as well, and I'll see if I can work it into a future Facebook Live. All right, my friends, so do you know that while we were busy planting all these beautiful flowers, a pig broke into our garden, my friends. And you
You know what this pig was trying to do? This pig was trying to dig up all of these fruits and vegetables and flowers. So we're gonna move on to our next special rhyme all about this piggy. All right, I can't find the piggy. I'm gonna look for him now. Oh, I think he's coming. All right, oh, there he is. Okay, my friends, look what the piggy did. The piggy dug up some of those pretty daffodils that we planted. But let's find out what he is up to. Where are you going, big pig, big pig? Out to the garden to dig, dig, dig. Out to the garden to dig, dig, dig. Shame on you, big pig, big pig. I'm sorry, ma'am, but I'm only a pig. All I can do is dig, dig, dig and rest. So it sounds like that little farmer was trying to ask the piggy what he was up to. And he said, I'm sorry, ma'am, I'm just a pig. That's what I do, I dig. All right, let's try it again. And if you notice, when I'm talking like the little farmer, I tap my sticks together like this. Did you see what I did when I was talking like the pig? That's right, I tapped the sticks on the floor instead. All right, let's try that together. Where are you going, big pig, big pig? Out to the garden to dig, dig, dig. Out to the garden to dig, dig, dig. Shame on you, big pig, big pig. I'm sorry, ma'am, but I'm only a pig. All I can do is dig, dig, dig and rest. Nice job, my friends. Okay, we can put our sticks away because we are all done with our sticks. And I see that my friend Nora is watching us all the way from Kentucky. Hello, Nora. I'm from the Georgia, so I'm from the South too. And Marin, hi Marin. I'm glad you're tuning in. And now, my friends, it's, it's time for us to get out our twinkling star fingers. Can I see your twinkling star fingers? And again, my friends, we are here every single Monday at 1015 and 1115. Please consider making a financial donation to help us keep our doors open. I am absolutely dedicated, more than you could possibly imagine, to making sure that Miss Claire's Many Musicians not only survives, this uh, indefinite and unexpected closure, but that we come back stronger than ever. So even just a small amount, even if it's just $5, that really can make a big difference. There's a lot of you all out there watching and asking for money from people is not an easy thing for me at all. So please know this is my least favorite part of my virtual classes, but it is unfortunately a necessary part. So thank you for considering making a financial contribution at PayPal or Venmo. Okay. Song time! Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are, up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Let's sing goodbye to each other, my friends. Here we go. Goodbye, my friends. It's time to say farewell. We sang up high, we sang down low, we moved our bodies to and fro, but now it's time to go. Blow a kiss, give a squeeze, wave goodbye now if you please. Adios. Oh, thank you so much, my friends. It was so good to see you. And now let's go ahead and remind each other that if you look right above me, you will see the ways, uh, the next one please, you will see the ways in which you can help us out. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, my friends. We're gonna do another class at 1115 for a slightly younger age range. We're doing zero to 23 months. So I hope to see you again next week. And please post pictures and comments on these videos. I love, love, love to see my mini musicians out there. As I said at the beginning of the video, I'm missing them so much. I miss their joyful energy. I can't wait to be together in person again. All right, take care, bye-bye.